Hello folks, I am uh, Brian and I would like to welcome you all to a short doc documentary on Radio Salesian. Today is uh, 13th February 2018 and that is World Radio Day. I am standing here in Gorabari, a small place outside Sonada, outside one of the oldest academic institutions in Darjeeling, Salesian College. Now some of you might be wondering what is the connection between uh, World Radio Day and one of the oldest academic institutions. Well, I'll let you know. Uh, Salesian College holds you know the first and the only campus based community radio radio salation in its uh, premise so uh, today I'm going to uh, show you around the campus as well as uh, radio salation in particular and uh, we'll show you how things go about we'll meet various RJs and uh, of course we are going to have a lot of fun so please follow me So we are getting closer to the studio and right now behind me you can see a van which is very cherished and that has uh, traveled international borders. Uh, so uh, we'll talk about that a bit later but right now uh, follow me and uh, we will go inside. But first let me show you another thing. Uh, that is there, there is one huge board. You know, a huge poster that depicts the uh, local culture as well as the array of uh, programs that Radio Salesian has to offer. So, as you can see, I, I told you before, and as you can see, behind me is a huge poster of uh, Radio Salesian. And towards my right, uh, you can see the local culture and, uh, you know, the various uh, glimpses of local culture. And uh, towards my left, there is an array of uh, programs that Radio Salesian has to offer. Well, actually, it's just behind my back. Towards my left, also, there is uh, the glimpses of uh, local culture. But my point is, these are the various uh, programs that Radio Salesian has to offer and each of them are specially tailored, specially, uh, you know, uh, focused on the upliftment of the community. So I guess you all are very much interested to see the studio. So am I. So uh, let's stop the talking and let's go inside and visit the, the studio. So as uh, usual, you can just follow me. So we are finally inside this uh, wonderful studio and uh, I am talking in a uh, low voice because uh, two RJs are already at work, right RJ Zemir? Yes, RJ Sagar and RJ Moses we have with them and their show is going on. Yes, so uh, let me introduce to you uh, the one on your right is uh, RJ Moses and the one on your left is uh, RJ Sagar and he's also lovingly called by the fans as uh, Mr. Samar. Uh, so you can see the huge, uh, you know, flex behind the background radio solution, and that itself gives a very uh, wonderful feeling. You know, whenever I enter into the uh, studio, and uh, in front you can uh, see that they are talking into two um, microphones. Uh, that uh, that is. Um, they are called condenser microphones and uh, you know each of them are very sensitive and they pick up a great sound and the heart of this uh, station is powered uh, by the Behringer uh, Zenix QX832 mixing console which is hooked onto the computer and also to the transmitter which uh, I will show you after a bit but right now let's focus on the mixing console it has got uh, plenty of uh, inputs you know sometimes uh, we have uh, many guests sometimes we've got many RG is coming in here uh, so you know it's it's always uh, very helpful to have a bit of uh, extra uh, inputs uh, there so there are other uh, studio rooms as well so uh, I will show you around so we we'll leave this uh, studio room and we'll enter into another so let's not this still uh, we've come to another room of our radio station and here I have with me RJ Regina. Hello Regina. Uh, so uh, she is uh, in this particular room we tend to record things uh, which is supposed to go live later and uh, we do all the extra works here whatever is required and after we put into our live shows we do the editing and plus making our shows recording and even if uh, some guests come we tend to put our guests here and then uh, we tend to record things. That's how we go about it. Although it looks tiny, but uh, so many, um, you know, important things go about in this room. 
we've come to another room and this room is slightly bigger than what we had uh, shown earlier and you can consider this room to be the main production unit and here I have with me RJ Smriti here who is editing her show she is part of some of the shows here and then she is continuously doing her good job of course and whatever band comes whatever recordings that we have to go about we bring the ba uh, band members here and uh, all the recording goes about in this room so uh, right now there is a very important person of uh, uh, Radio Salesian uh, sitting behind me and he is working, he is one of you know the most popular RJs in uh, Radio Salesian, a multi-talented person, the program coordinator of uh, Radio Salesian uh, as well as uh, the director of this uh, short uh, documentary. So come and let's uh, talk to him a, a little uh, while. So hello uh, RJ Samir. Hi RJ Brian and uh, hello to all our listeners viewers and yes uh, all the students okay so uh, you know I would just uh, ask you one question you know I'm always uh, envious of uh, the way you handle everything so you know how do you do all these things uh, well uh, I've been to many FM stations as a guest and um, before coming to this community FM station I worked for uh, other commercial stations so uh, past 10 years I've learned a lot and uh, this you know um, this shows in my day-to-day -day work. Yeah, of course, this definitely shows in his day-to-day uh, uh, -day work and he is a very busy man, people, so I should not uh, disturb him. Uh, but we will uh, talk to the other most important uh, uh, man of this uh, Radio uh, Salesian and that is uh, the director of Radio Salesian. So, uh, folks, uh, I am here with the main person behind uh, Radio Salesian, the director, the station director, as well as uh, the vice principal of uh, Salesian College, uh, Father C. M. Paul. Uh, so, uh, we uh, go and talk to him a bit about uh, Radio Salesian. So, Father, uh, welcome uh, to this uh, documentary. Thank you. And. Um, Radio Solution uh, started from the 8th December 2016 and uh, during this one year it has accomplished many things and notably it has tied up with uh, uh, you know tied up in the sense it has uh, done various uh, programs and it has also gone for an Indo-Nepal friendship uh, tour uh, so could you tell me and uh, uh, the audience a bit more about this actually Radio Solution took off as a web radio on 28th of October that was the day of the Diwali. It was our gift to the Prabhasi uh, Nepali people all over the world. Then our actual broadcast, the terrestrial broadcast took place on 8th of December. And from then on we have been moving ahead and ahead with the new ventures and new programs and uh, reaching out to new groups of people. And it was in one such um, uh, expedition that we went to Nepal, Indo-Nepal Friendship Tour with the two RJs, that is RJ Samir and RJ Sagar and our driver Mr. Rai, uh, Mr. Kabi Tamang and our uh, good old uh, Maruti van of 2005 model and all decked up and we covered a distance of uh, 1,606 kilometers. Along the way we, we met up with uh, other radio stations, for instance in Dharan we met up with uh, Radio Purvanchal no, was it Purbanchal? Okay, and then uh, in um, uh, Biratma, Biratnagar, we met up with the one and only radio station entirely managed by women. Yeah, then we uh, went to Kathmandu and we met up with the first uh, community radio of South Asia and of uh, Nepal, which was started in 1997, Radio Sagarmata. And we had a good exchange with them and we learned a lot of stuff with them and they even shared some of their programs and series, uh, serials with them, uh, especially the radio plays in Nepali. It has been a very great success for us to have visited all along the way to different institutions. Also, we visited uh, seven of our Salesian institutions. It is keeping the 25th anniversary of uh, the Nepal mission. So we visited them, we did some live programs also and uh, the surprise was we had also a meeting with uh, the bishop, the one and only bishop of uh, Nepal, uh, Bishop Paul Simic, he was a friend of mine from Calcutta days and uh, 
It was happy to see us there. He welcomed all of us, and it was a great meeting. We also landed up at uh, Indian Embassy to give a surprise to them. So it was a wonderful experience. So, uh, folks, uh, this was uh, a very short. Uh, and a sweet uh, documentary on how we do things how things are done here at Radio Salesian and uh, I hope you all enjoyed uh, as much as we enjoyed making this uh, documentary and I would like to thank the director Mr. Samir who is at present behind the camera and who will do all the post production as well as the station director and all the RJs and uh, special thanks to you folks who have given us time by watching this documentary Thank you so much. This is your host, your Shuli R.J. Bryan, signing off. Salation 90.8 FM, Voice of the Hills.